back now with a struggle for a veteran from Suffolk and his wife. They have gone through months of hassles with the Hampton VA trying to get him a custom wheelchair. Investigative reporter Chris Horn looks at why it means so much more than just a way to get around. We're out in Suffolk in front of the home of Barry Paul. The former Navy diver had this ramp built by his son several years ago. At least now he can use it. He ordered a custom wheelchair several months ago, finally got it this week. Barry and Rose Paul have their memories of his 27 years as a diver. Unfortunately, his mobility is now just a memory too after he suffered a stroke. I can't walk too well. Sometimes I can't even walk. I fall down, I let go down, boom. The Pauls ordered Barry a custom wheelchair through the VA in April, and then they went around in circles trying to get it. It was just one thing after another. Rose Paul says she was having a hard time getting anywhere with the staff at the Hampton VA. I'd call and ask about it and didn't hear anything, so I'd have to get in the car and drive over and personally speak to somebody. And then in September, she discovered the order had been lost. And I said, well, can you look back and see if it was ordered back in April? Because I've been told it was April and all this. And uh, she looked back and said there had never been an order until that day. The chair arrived in mid-October, but wouldn't run after the first day. Finally, a rep from the manufacturer arrived this week and got it working properly more than six months after it was ordered. It's made a big difference in his attitude and all. That's got to improve your quality of life. Oh, yeah. You wish me away for a while. <laughs> and now he can roam the yard and roam the neighborhood. The VA will not comment on Barry Paul's specific case. This past year, the hospital says it filled orders for about 100,000 pieces of custom equipment. That covers a number of different types of equipment, and that was a 9% increase over the previous year. And the head of physical medicine and rehab says the wait time for a custom chair should be more like six to eight weeks, and then staff follows up. You come in, we make sure you're safe, we teach you how to use it, we teach your family how to use it. Looks like Barry Paul is already up to speed. So that will be the ongoing challenge for the Hampton VA Medical Center. Managing its expansion and an ever growing caseload, but also keeping the wait times for things like custom wheelchairs within range. In Hampton, Chris Horn, 10 on your side.